Any change in your circumstances is going to require a change in you. Whether you want to move up, you want to move on, you want to move in to something new. If the change does not also happen within you, you are going to repeat whatever it is that you are trying to escape. And for many of us, when we set goals, when we try that new job, that new relationship, the new wardrobe, whatever it is that you're trying to do, you are trying to create a new life. And this is a mistake that I see a lot of women making is that we can change our clothes, we can change our hair, we can change our image, we can change our relationship, we can change our job, we can move from one city to another, we can move from one country to another. But if the same woman is going with you, then what happens is she will recreate the old life in the new place. And it's going to feel as if you're doing all the right things and yet you're getting the wrong results. And it's because if you have not dealt with the woman within, it doesn't matter where you go. It doesn't matter what new thing you do. If the old woman is still within you, there's a scripture that says, if any man be in Christ, it, it words it that way, but it says, if any person is in Christ. He's a new creature. Old things are passed away. All things have become new. There are so many women who are, you're believing God for a breakthrough. You're believing in God for a miracle. The breakthrough is not just in your circumstance. Do not limit your blessing or your breakthrough to just your circumstance. The blessing and the breakthrough also happens within you. And it also happens so you can be a blessing to others in that new place, in that new space, in that new job, in that new relationship, through your new lifestyle. You will be a blessing to others because you will be new. And when you're new, it expands what's, what you are capable of and it expands what is available to you. It expands your impact. It expands so many things, but if you are not willing to also become new, then your vision for your life, for yourself, for whatever it is you're trying to accomplish is limited because the vision is not only limited to what you will accomplish. The vision also includes who you will become. So who do you want to become? Change is necessary. Change is necessary for the vision to come to pass. I hope this helps. If it has, give, give this video a thumbs up, leave a comment below, and I want to wish you blessings on your journey. I'll talk to you soon.